Okay, so here we are. I am on top of this huge big platform here with MC Oda down below, and I am going to do a water bucket clutch from world build height all the way down to absolute bedrock. And I am terrified, I've got vertigo. Oh man, it's just, it's so far down, I can't even see the hole. How do I meant to know where I'm going? <laughs> oh, it's it's easy. I, I just did it, man. You just have to jump straight down. It's not that hard. Straight down. All right. Straight okay. down. Uh-huh. All right. In three, two, one, and go. Oh, I don't know if I went straight down. I feel like I took a step. I feel like this is bad. Oh no, I'm coming down. I'm coming down. Wait, wait, I'm lined up with it. I'm going to make it. I'm the king of the world. I'm going to make it. Yes, I got through the hole. I'm going to make it. I'm going to be the world champion bucket clutcher of the... Oh, I hate you so much, MC Yoda. <laughs> you are the worst. I will have my revenge. G'day guys and welcome back to the Craftworks SMP. I am standing on this very beautiful bridge. Oh, don't show that. Uh, and I have behind me here a little area. You can see all the red little L's on the, down the riverside there. Um, I am going to be mainly building here today. I had a couple of people come over and help with the bit that I've already built there in past present tense. Uh, so have a look at this. Yep. So, so, so we're going to have <laughs> this dark oak stuff going all the way down the edge of the top here then followed by a row of obviously this and then it'll be bricks and granite and mud and all the other stuff whatever it is yeah. um so going so the bricks all the way are like down the walkway, the walkway. Right. And yeah this would yeah. be like yeah. a little pier type yeah a pier type yeah. thing that people can put their things on the buildings will be back at this level um, so this is the area for for this sort of so building. So this is the face, and it's facing out towards. <coughs> yes. Austin. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Okay. And then they're going to keep going at this same level, like a like rows of, right, like the row buildings are packed real tight. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. sort of whatever they are, be it shops, yeah, like be different, it, different. Uh, uh, yeah, cafes, like restaurants, accesses. whatever. Yeah, 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 and all yeah. different mm -hmm. colors and people's own designs on them, providing they nice. stick to my basic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can all do whatever you like, but <laughs> you have to do but what I. Here's so. the six blocks I want you to build. Out of. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, and so that can go down as far as it needs to go. Uh, but I thought, yeah, this whole area would be really nice if it was a big row of sort of shops and things coming down the front. Yeah, for sure. Hmm. Very. I'm trying to think. I mean, I saw the picture, I guess, the concept picture, so that makes yeah. more sense now. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, I can picture it in my head. Can't think of places I've seen those before. It's almost kind of like a diagon alley a little bit. Uh, yeah, kind of. Yeah. I think it's a European type thing. It's definitely. I, European, Amsterdam. Yeah. yeah. It's sort of, yeah. that Amsterdam was where I found has it. it. Paris has it along their river. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Uh, we are terraforming and building. Hmm. What are you building? Um. Hills. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're doing. Hills. We're doing. No, actually, hold on, hold on. Hills. We got to. We got the, the test. It's the test. Where? The where Zink is standing. What are these? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> we got another tiebreaker <laughs> going on here. What are these? Or what are what, they yeah. supposed to represent? What do they? Re what, what do they represent? What do they represent. Well, what are you building? No, that's the thing it's, you have that, to just. That wasn't the question. You have to just guess based <laughs> on. Yeah, walk up to it and say, "What does it look like?" Like yeah, you walk you up and be like, it, "Oh, look, those are blah blah blahs." This is a placeholder yeah. for what? <laughs> oh, a, pla a placeholder. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> they kind of look like a seat, like you sit right here, or something. <laughs> So close. <laughs> Look. Oh, Feather's coming over. Feather, quick, come over and tell me how, how right I am that these are tables and chairs. What? <laughs> oh, God. Just the <laughs> Look, this will be a chair here, and this will be a table in the middle, and then this will be a chair facing this way. What? 
Oh, let me see. You've got no vision. Okay. Um, we are building. Am I still not working. You're working. There you are. Yay! I have to restart my game. Uh, and Zing. all that time you were saying these table and chairs look beautiful, and and well, no one could hear you. Saying, yeah. Were you alive in the seventies? Yes, I was. Very. And so you were here for the sunken the, earth. The, yeah. Yeah, there right? Is. Yeah, no one remembers that, but I do. I remember, I remember this. It. Yeah, yeah, I this, <laughs> this, hey, I'm not that the bad. sunken yeah, table, dirt, dirt chair yeah, section. That was beautiful in the city. Disco was big. Oh, the Bee Gees were a hit. <laughs> it was a great time. What a great time. Dirt chairs and sunken <laughs> tables. Yeah, sunken tables. <laughs> I'm here for it. Dirt chairs and icebox refrigerators. That's what we're here for. That's it. Okay, okay, stop, stop, stop. <laughs> so here's the problem when you get on an smp and you've got a group of friends with you you end up spending a lot of time talking and having fun times and all the rest of it and as much as content is being produced as much as we built this walkway um it was so much fun that i could just sit here and include the whole thing and i'd be happy and you'd be sitting here for the next couple of hours wondering why you're here so how about i explain it this brown area here, this is like a, this is going to be for like tables and chairs and that sort of thing, decorations and things. The brick area is going to be for the walkway. And then here, like I'm going to build something here, the first spot next to the bridge here. And then people will go down. Now there's a problem. The problem is when you're on an SMP, you have... 21 people who all have a different vision. Now, that's fine. When you look at, say, these two buildings here, we've got Impala and Lane's house here, and they have built very similarly to one another to have a style or whatever. Then over here, you've got Otis Place and half of my place, because only half of it is rendered in. Um, and they're sort of similar style, and that was intentional. Then you've got Cube's place here, which looks very different. Millie's place, Tobes's place, Cap's little hole in the ground there. Um, you've got Impala's place over the back there. You've got this whopping great portal here that Oda built, beautiful as it is. It always reminds me of something. I don't know what it is. But I'll just keep plugging away. Um, so we've got, and we've got this building here, and then we've got Melissa's building down there. I'm not meant to show that, but look at how beautiful this is. Watch Melissa's channel, you'll see that. Um, and even over here, you know, you've got you've got Melissa's cart here, and then you get the point, right? There's a whole lot of different styles all melding together. And what I really want for on the other side of the bridge, not that it's my place to say, but what I really want is for a row of shops that are all similarly themed. So not exactly the same, but similarly themed and similarly, similarly sort of uh, shaped. So that's the intention. I'm going to get building on this first plot here and uh, let's see what we get. I can almost hear it now. But Sinkberg... Why is there no time lapse? Well, there's a good reason that there's no time lapse, and that is that I am just placing blocks. I have a, a very, very vague idea of how I want this thing to look, and I am going to be putting things down, taking things off, putting things down, taking them off, right? Stop looking at my pretty face and look at the building behind me. Wait. Yes. Good. Um, so... This is my idea, right? I've got I've got a few things. I've got the the blue what's it called? Blue woody stuff. You know the blue woody stuff. <laughs> I've got that, I've got the quartz, and I've got the red terracotta in there. That's that's it. That's my whole idea at this point in time. And I've got this sort of vague shape. And the shape is that. It's a rectangle with a thing coming off the front of it. There are some things I don't like. I don't like the blue shutters next to the windows. I am struggling with the white around the middle window down the bottom. I don't know if I like that shape very much. But look, I'm basically going to place some blocks and have a look at it. And let's see if we can make a change and, and sort of develop this into something that's much more interesting.
So let's start with one of the things that's annoying me most, which is the bit surrounding that window in the middle there, this bit here. Let's fix that up. That looks too chunky. And I, yeah, I don't know. I don't even know if that's necessary at all, but let's have a look. If we take out those and take out that and replace them with slabs, let's have a look and see how it looks. Um, mm, I can already feel that it's a no from me. Let me have a look. Yeah. Mm. I'm not overly wrapped with that either. Um, it looks better, but it's still very blocky and very chunky. So we'll work some more on that. Uh, the I don't like the blue shutters. So I might get rid of those. I wonder if this would look better with stairs. Maybe it would. Let's have a look at that. Let's let's see. And this is what I do, right? Is just I'm going to go around and and remove things that I don't like and then and then put down things I do. Some people like to go into a creative world and and build it. Mm, of course I put the stair down. <sighs> um go into a creative world first and build these sorts of things. I don't feel like I need to. I feel like I'm going to place the blocks anyway. I might as well just place them here. It would be easier if I got to jump around in creative, but I, I sort of like this experience of doing that. It looks a little bit better. That looks a little bit better. I don't know. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, everything's almost insta mine anyway when you've got a couple of netherite tools, which I do have. Do you see that? That I've got netherite. Um, and uh, yeah, just just sort of, ew, no, that looks a lot worse. Um, yeah, just, just place things down and see how they look until we get to a better point. So let's see if we can get to a better point. Now, listen, I am just over here building. I don't need your angst. Now, they're all going to run at me. <laughs> well, I missed with the second shot. No, oh, no. I don't want it. I don't ouch. <laughs> All right, line up, line up one at a time. Go on. All right, uh, three. No, ow, ow, ow. Well, actually, you know what? It's not ow, ow, ow too much. <laughs> now they're hitting each other. Hey, you're dead. You're dead. No, go. In fact, it barely hurts at all. Like it, it doesn't, I'm, I've got to be, I was going to say, I've got to be covered in arrows, surely. Do I have, maybe I have projection, what is it, pro, pro, projectile protection, 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 no, just regular protection. How did I, how did that not, look at that one's like through my throat. It's got to be going to my heart, doesn't it? I mean, aside from the fact that it's going through my face, that's got to hurt. Okay, now what was I saying before I was so rudely interrupted by those guys? Uh, yes, something more. We we are up to something more. Have a look. Look. So I did away with that middle window altogether. I put two lots of double windows in the middle section and stuck some planters down. And I think that looks a lot better. I think maybe I'm trying to do too much with it, like trying to get it to look too fancy. From the bridge here, it looks pretty good. The new top section looks good. Um, there's there's a whole lot going on here that looks a lot better. Um, the, yeah, I, the, mm, I wish that those trapdoors on the front could be a different color, but I, I really can't. They look sort of like a fringe, and I, I like that look, like especially as you step back. Um, now, the top section over here, this bit here I really like. I, I think that looks good, and from a distance, even though it's a little bit pointy, I think it looks good. And a lot of a lot of what I'm doing here will depend on what the other crafters do when they build, and hopefully they'll build something that sort of comes along with this theme. But... I, I like there are a couple of little touches in there that I'm really enjoying. I prefer this look to the um, to the other one. I yeah, I I really starting to like this. Let's do more, and I'll come back and talk about it. Now I have just discovered I don't actually have flowers, and well, stop. Look at this little shop. Look at the shop that Millie did. It is gorgeous. Look at that color is the name of it. 
It's absolutely beautiful. Just so much detail. It's why she is legitimately one of my favorite builders in Minecraft. She's just so fantastic. Prices are marked on barrel. Ask about our trade specials. Well, I have trade requests. I want million. No, I don't want millions. This is my favorite flower, as we all know. One diamond per stack. Well, there you go, Millie. That's what you get. One diamond. That's all I've got with me. I can't. <sighs> Do not use lilies for dyes. Okay. All right. Fair enough. I won't. Love this little greenhouse here. This looks beautiful. Wow. Oh, she's so good. It, it, it's, it's just such a magnificent build. Just all the little details. I love it. I love the pots up the top here. Well done, Millie. Awesome. Awesome job. I'm sorry that I only bought one diamond's worth. I will be back when I have many more diamonds, but I just need the orange flowers at the moment. Come on, horse with no name. I went round the portal on a horse with no name. Doop, doop. I came back to Millie's on a horse with no name. Okay, we have a problem. <laughs> as much as... Where am I? I'm here. As much as... Oh, I'm on... No, it doesn't matter. Um, as much as I love the orange flowers, which I've now put in the barrel over the other side, unfortunately, they don't go with the red. And... I think uh, this becomes a problem now because if I put white, it's going to mix really heavily with the with the uh, with the quartz. I'm thinking it has to be. I'm thinking it has to be white. A diamond per stack. Well, we just. How about if we take? We'll take a stack of those and. Uh, what, what else could it be? So red terracotta, red terracotta. Can I see my house from here? Can I, if I pop up, could I? Yes. Okay. It's that color. Um, I need a bed. Do you have a bed in here, Millie? I need to sleep. Help. No. Nah. It's outside. Um, okay. We'll shut the doors. And we'll hope that the nasties don't come and get us. Um, let's try with... We've got the white. What else do I use? I use a lot of the red. Let's let's try one diamond per stack. Let Again, I'm just double-checking the prices because they could be different based on popularity or something like that. Okay, so we'll try that. We've got, we've got three stacks of flowers that we can play around with. Well... I'm climbing vines. Okay. Now, look at how dangerous this area is. Um, and only half as dangerous as what it is across the bridge where I'm working. <laughs> um, all right. Let's go back. There's a beautiful build over there that K Hug has done. There's beautiful builds everywhere. It's gorgeous. This whole place is gorgeous. Um, whose house? Let's go and sleep in someone's house. Let's just randomly pick a house. Um, we'll go and we'll go into Tobes's. Let's let's go in. We'll we'll go and wipe our feet on Tobes's bed. Hang on. Let's. Uh, how do you get? How do you get in? Hello. Okay. All right. Let's go in. Oh, he's got. Oh, it's a nice white white bed too. We'll jump up and down on it a bit with our muddy feet. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I could have just come here. He's got all sorts of stuff in here. Look at that. I didn't know he's got all this. Um, okay. All right. We have we've done what we came to do. <laughs> we slept. He's got spikes in the middle of his ground. He's so dangerous. You've got to watch out for him. He's not, not to be trusted. Uh, okay. Let's head across and let's, uh, let's have a look at these flowers. Oh, see? Now, I thought I was going to put those white ones on and it was going to be perfect, but they're not. And you know what the biggest pain is? All three of them are off-centred either left or right, which is really annoying. Oh, hate that. Okay, well, let's hope that the red saves me because, boy, oh, boy, that's disappointing. Um, 
maybe, I mean, maybe we just drop the whole idea of the flowers up here altogether. Maybe, um, maybe we just need to put them on pots. Yeah, yup, yuck. It's not so much the color as it is what's happening to them, I think. Okay, I am not finished, but I'm getting there. I'm really getting there. This is going to have to be the end of it. I haven't got time, unfortunately. Let me eat one of them, just spit gold all over the floor. Let's have a look at where we're up to. And we're pretty close, I think. Um, this is my build. This is what we've ended up with. So let's have a look at the things that I was talking about before. So um, I'll go into free cam for this. So this area here, I went with my uh, bookshelf design in there just because I really love that thing and I'm just going to spam it everywhere I go. Oh, there, those my friends over there. Um, the red, I still feel like the red is a little plain, but it, but it's okay for this type of design. And I think once we have some other buildings going down the row that have different colours and things, it might start to look all right. Um, it, it doesn't look bad like this anyway. It's it's fine, but it just it could be a bit more. Um, yeah, so just some little little design things there. Putting a stair every now and then in these made it look sort of give it a little bit more texture in the face putting the little planters up the top here like this um, and the the uh, putting the iron gates in there with the bricks behind them on that level again I didn't like it on that level um, actually we can go back up and try that again because I have made a change so maybe that might look all right um, the the facade the top of the facade up here I'm fine with doing the rim around the edge made a big difference um down the front here i've just gone with two like bench style seats um and i have done some trapdoors next to the windows as well just to to give it a bit of a feel um we have planters on this part of the um of the walkway which had the little pictures on the sides and then the the trapdoors in there uh and Temporary seats, but with little tables. Um, temporary seats, just because I can't find a color which is right. If I go dark, then it blends in with this. If I go tough, then it looks sort of industrial. If I put stone, it looks silly. I need purple or something that looks like a padded seat. Let me sleep for a second. Okay, and... Uh, what else on the outside? Oh yes, just the slabs above the windows as a bit of a, um, you know, bit of a protector against the sun, whatever they, I don't know what they call those, actually. I have no concept of what they call those. And I didn't want to do it on the side because then it gets ruined by this little bit up here. So that's fine like that. We've got two little uh, fire escape sort of things with a ladder down here. Thank you, MC Oda for sharing with me how I can put a ladder in the air like that. That was a good good idea. I have a flower missing, that's okay. Uh, just the azaleas coming down there at the moment. I might do some more, but we'll see again what it looks like once other people have joined in and, and started building. And um, yeah, if if sort of you know if the crafters aren't interested, you know, I don't I don't police what they can and can't do. They can do what they want. If they want to join in, they can. I've had quite a bit of an in interest to it. So if we don't get a full row of shops, then I can add to it and put another building or two down. Um, a couple of pictures on the side, I thought like bill posters and things like that, that you would have on the wall. This will be a an interior wall. So the idea would be that the next building would sort of be there. Um, so there'd just be a small gap that people can walk down and it all sort of, it sort of looks more like graffiti or, or bill posters or something like that. Um, did like a broken up wall on the side there, uh, which I think looks pretty good. I like the look of that. Again, not so important because it's going to be in between, but I wanted to do the detail anyway, so that's all good. Um, now as to what, what am I selling? What am I going to sell? So let's just put that away before I forget. And no, the paintings can stay. I need to sort all of this out and get this junk out of here. Um, so what am I going to sell? I'm thinking, here's my idea. 
What if we had like a little ice cream shop, but instead of ice cream, we sold the colors of terracotta. So people could look at them in display and they'll have some ice creamy name. It'd be great if I could do like puns on the crafters names and have it like uh, Oda and I were talking before. Um, so Millie Vanilla um, or something like that, you know, like that sort of thing. Um, yeah, they've always got those weird names for ice creams. Well, they don't always. They used to. It, fudge Sundays and things always had the the weird names. Um, anyway, maybe something like that. So maybe this is a terracotta ch terracotta shop. Um, I'm thinking that's probably the way I'll go, and I'll probably try and interiorize it like it's an ice cream shop. I don't know what color the door's going to be yet. Maybe blue. Is it too much blue if I've got a blue door? Um, I, it'd almost look good with a red door. Let's have a look and see. Oh look, I get three for the price of one. That was good. Uh, let's put that back. Let's have a look with the blue door. What do we get when we have a blue door? I, I think it's gonna look very bubblegum sort of colored. And yeah, that's all right. We'll stick with that. We'll stick with that for now. Um, and we'll put one down at the back. How long have I been playing this game? And why Why do I keep doing things like that? Okay, so the interior is nothing so far. We have a picture on the wall, which looks like a skeleton in a fortune cookie. Uh, <clears throat> then we have the stairs that come up here and go around and then there's a second floor up here for whatever and then we come up the stairs and go around and up here we've got another level up here i'd say that this one i'm probably going to play it out like this is my storage so once i have some shulkers and i can actually get some stock together um then that one up there will be that but maybe this one too i mean we'll see see how we go but i haven't decorated them yet um but I think, yeah, I think I think this looks pretty cool as far as this design of shop goes. And, and as I've said before, I haven't built in this design before. So to me, it looks really cool. It, it sort of upsets me a little bit that the height of this is the same as the height of the bridge. Um, but, but that's okay. It, it doesn't necessarily take away from the magnitude of the bridge. Um, it just change, it just increases the magnitude of the uh, <laughs> of the building, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, so that's it, guys. That's all I've got for you this week. Um, I yeah, I'm sorry I didn't have more interactions and things. I I didn't have a lot of that stuff for this week, unfortunately. Um, we're going back to just one a week. Uh, the, the two a week thing, it was way too much for me. Um, I, as much as I tried, I just, just couldn't keep it up um, while I was doing that. So we'll go back to one a week. We might look in the very near future at changing the day we release on, but I'll have a look at that too. So for now, guys, it's me, Zinkerberg, signing off. I never say that. I've never said that. I'm, I'm not going to start now. That's horrible. Guys, you know the drill. I love you guys all to death. Thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate every single one of you and everything you do for me. If you like what you saw, please like the video, leave a comment, subscribe to my channel, do all the things. Uh, and I will see you next week uh, for, a, for a, regular, uh, a regular episode, I think. All right, guys, have a great week. I'll catch you later. Bye.